Love that as well. The smoke comes through just as there's no contact elsewhere. Wow. Wait, the they're all one HP. Oh, Victor. Victor for two. He's playing further ahead. Victor and yay. The combination deadly. And a flawless beginning for Optic. She shocked her on this map. Or did... Shocked her in general are ridiculous on this. Kills force them to reinvest. But we've also seen the other look to Optic to an extent in my mind as well as the yay got quelled. He got, you know, really pushed down a couple of times. Counted on some of his aggression a little bit here and there. So I do want to see how they look going forward because I was really enjoying watching Loud play this earlier on. I got to, you know, catch back up on that really spend some time going over it. and to me pancada was fantastic at being a, a threat and a nuisance so again that mild pancada battle going on the omens lovely no that's a cool dart see that it landed Another on top of the default. I wonder if that was a lineup. Going through the motions. Just that, and we have seen a few examples of isolated instances yes but of the tank coming through huge. as well. This is huge. Great work from Aspas to stem the bleeding on hand. Flash Victor wants to get a little feisty with it, and yeah, he does. Them. Lovely work from Victor. Pancada's still standing though, and it is a 2v2. So this should, should be contained. Oh, but they're just so Austin is so hurt. Oh, should come through now. Crash, he should be able to find himself an upgrade though. Oh my gosh. They got the bonus. That's the beginning for the boys there. They will be loving a little bit of something to it. But again, keeping it simple. We're going to go for that B piece already. You can see Optic respecting that enough to sit deep on Bow House, make them kind of work for their dinner. And information now does get revealed, but the gap already closed. So FNS is going to try and find an angle, but the flash is very good. Oh my gosh. That was Sadak as well. So for now, Optic still holding for the back side. Less is the only one to really connect so far for Loud, but they have at least got a step towards the site here. Backline's being addressed. Oh. Less, that's the big shot, though. Pancada makes this almost feel possible. Less comes in, and Less has the spike not too far away. Can he find a singular fight, though? He needs to avoid that for one. Uses the turret to try and close in towards the site. Gonna go for the plant. Compared. He's gonna pop that down. The madman. This is madness from that 17 HP, and he is willing to throw us down seven seconds. They have to make the move within it. A couple more, and they have to make the play. What does he do with this? The spam comes in. Oh. It's dealt with well. An optic play as a collective. There's no individual fights on that. They timed it nicely. Greet this. Loud just have to go back to basics, almost just the gun at the side. And Aspas going to show him how it's done, but he's taking a whole lot of damage. Sadak still stands and still finds work, but FNS deep tucked towards hell. They found crashes. FNS on the side. Wow, they somehow they somehow got in. That's crazy. Comfortable enough for a plant here. I think they know he's opping. Not going to happen. Sassy well composed, and we have to kind of let's talk about that round because it's and the lockdown for the recap. Wait, does Sassy have shock darts? He yeah, might have shock dart lineups. There's no, what can you do with this 17 seconds? Plant's gonna oh, come no in. shock dart, unless he's in such an annoying spot, has to make a run for it. Gonna get himself out towards the back side of wine, just about. They look like the pass. They have. He likes to get it halfway. FNS on guard duty. Gonna get one. He's not stopping. Yay! He's not stopping. Oh wow! From hell or high water, El Diablo will always be dangerous. This guy pops the knives, gets hyper aggressive. Less happy to lead this. As of Aspas with him, they've got a good surround on the side, but they're not yet quite breaking in to be able to get that spike down. And there's still three players potentially to clear. So, but it's a five v three. They have the advantage here to play trades and. Crashes will be called upon. He's actually going to get picked out. It's an absolute Good. shutdown, though. FNS and Yay looking comfortable. Give them just enough room. As Yay still backside. The, the composure of every piece of this. They were knocking on the door. They, they were halfway in the site. And Optic look on. But free to be able to come. Oh, wow. He's potentially two there, I think. Sussy and maybe less, both noted. Left. So that's enough to pull everyone over anyway. FNS can still hold mid in case there's a late rotation or something happens. But again, look at the time being bought here. The clock is an opponent for Optic in this, and they are just playing it perfectly. Tim, they keep jiggling out the up. It's fine. He's still holding position. Pressure. It's going to be the crossfire that holds. Yes. And it's so Beautiful. resilient. Optic are no playing one. a near on flawless game here, Mike. And this is something I did not expect. I thought over. It's not over yet. A double walk on it. Oh, God, uh, oh he splashed himself. That's going to be fine. Finds Victor, Shoot. wants another. He's so ready for a mark. That's well enough here, but FNS can hear this cross. But he knows there's a trap on the other side. He's so aware of this man. He's got oh. two. How do you get two off of that? Oh, he's just absolutely unleashing today. That's two big kills. That's going to keep this round somewhat feeling safer. As already Crash is closing in. Going to take the spike away from them. And it's just Aspas left in a 1v2. And it's not happening. It's a one. This scoreline 
is just running away from them. They're getting out. But he's still fine. He seems to be good for at least one at this point. So ready on the site. Flash comes in. Victor goes through. Does his best impression. Oh, I thought he had two there. Not to be. They skip their lives. Aspas still standing. Player tucked towards hell. He's marmed. Gets himself out. Has a little look. Is he going to cancel? For now, and oh, no, he didn't. Waiting. Yay. Oh, yeah, he Has did. A couple of options. Takes one. Ten seconds left. Yeah, with him and the 2v2 sprays in. It ain't clean for the swing from Crash. He's trying to capitalize on the time. Wow. That's like, I don't understand how they... And loud, stabilized for just a second. It's crazy how... Waiting to whine on this. Sadak, Aspas have to clear this because look who's lurking. It's going to be Yay from the back lines. And he's still finding shots. And he's still being a problem. As only one stands in it's Aspas. And he does not feel safe. He has players just about everywhere. He would have to go hero mode if he wants to save this round. It's just beautiful left. to watch. And now Aspas, like I said, in an unwinnable position here. The 1v3, not even going to find the first hurdle. Yay will close it out. What a round from Optic. Fast mid adjustment. It looks like they have the correct read right now. And they just don't expect it. He's still dealt with Sadak. He turned away from Aspas, but now the lockdown is going to come in. And yeah, he's going to over, over push. And he does go down. Great trade from Aspas. Wow. Who is the only one trying to do this right now for Loud? Putting in a great performance. Three of them still alive. It's Crash. He's marved on the other side. HP's a little low, but they have the numbers. One goes in. Oh, the snap from Crashies. Someone check on that man's wrists. The sassy now. The spike has to do it all on his own, and the information play coming in. Sassy, though, he's closing in. A nice amount of HP to work with, but he's still got a chance in this. They have no idea where he's at right now. They've set up the crossfire. Does it hold? Sassy walks in. He's found an optic. All oh, looking formidable. A 10 to half is exceeding. Oh, do you know what's on the other side? Oh, that's beautiful from Pancada. Cover going Huge kill. Massive kill because it looked like the rotation was the intention as they're going to be leaning around towards that tree side. Four of the players down for Optic. Working their way through. And Loud shutting the door on this. They want none of what they're trying to sell. Aspas going to keep them busy. Going to fall away to a safer angle. As what? Optic, what are you up to, Marv? You're getting real dangerous on this. And this is a shutdown. Loud waking up. And that is what we need to see. Four standing. A good read. And no over peaks. No over A long road back in, but a capable side. You're only just seeing them now. You've missed a hell of a lot, but they are damn good at what they do loud, so give them a moment. Let's watch how it looks. And Carter can get the first mm. contact, and also just going to claim the scalp of Yay. Oh, that actually does. Still a back again. That's a little bit of a bait here, but nice. yeah, sets, sets it up perfectly. That's it. That's lovely. Cleaning up on the flawless in that second round here on the second half. If they win. Down, so it does seem as though they've broken through on the side. They pulled the rotation. Just perfectly. Marv gonna catch this as well. Sadak, do you check it? Nah, not a shot. Free fire. Almost from Marv there. <laughs> what are you doing on the way back in? Back up's got a bulldog, I guess. The rest, not so equipped. Oh, okay. Ooh. No, it's fine. Apparently, the uh, Marshall is good to go. My bad. Really if Pankata can fight this guy. It does a little possible. It's this mid fight to me, right? Marv looks so on the money for it. He seems super aware of this possibility. How does Pankata approach it? Obviously, none the wiser to what's noise. behind him. And yeah, it's going to be the reveal. Beautiful work from Marv. His patience is paying off. Oh. Composed calm. <gasps> the dart. But they have slipped through. So now FNS. We're just going to feel the bird and oh the no. brunt of it all. He's gone down. Now Marv's trying to sweat bullets. He's going to get back to sight. <gasps> oh my gosh. Sassy. They won it. He's got the time on the defuse. They yeah. Honestly, I'll take it. Sadak this time. He's going to be the one to deal with a whole lot. If he swings too wide, he's fine. It's three. Oh, it just slices them apart. And Optic going to lose much of the potential of this round, maybe if they wanted to get a little bit more away from Loud, not going to be the case. FNS, yeah, you've threaded the needle a little bit, but... Have I told you a story about the 1v4 with FNS I'm all is. <laughs> I am all is. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's crazy. It starts off, he, like, threads through tree, right? And then he goes up towards, kind of, you know, the rafters does on the other side. Does he get Aspas first? Well, you think he does, but actually, it's Pancada. I'm lying. It, it is Aspas, of course. And then he gets the operator, kills him. And then it just, you know, it, oh, <laughs> it's, um, it's it was actually one, uh, in a different game. But, but he was taking too long to decide. Exactly really, they just clear it, right? Is he going to peek it? Just try and deal with what's coming your way. Quickly dealt with on the first, Jay. Gonna work his way in towards the site. And now you've got to look at the second string to this. The people behind, Yay. Does he go? Yeah, he actually found Sadak there. I thought they might have noticed him slipping through. At least kept it in mind, but it wasn't the case at all. And he's still being a nuisance. Two up towards the rafters and Aspas trying to clear through, but you can see the nuisance this man is. And Yay won't stop. Just ripping <laughs> them apart. 
three. And now two, Pancada and Aspas still alive, but where are they and what can they do with this? One by tree, one towards rafters. Operated to hand and they need more than this. They need that springboard suppressed again. So few options. And it looks like they're on the verge of giving this one up at this point. Yeah, he's still prowling around, gets found. Can there be an answer back? Oh, Pancada's found another. Oh my oh, gosh, how did they win that? That's, That's insane. Be worried about. That's up with the operator, so not really feeling any pressure just yet. Other than that. <laughs> Other than that. Well, defeated. Uh, uh, tick. Uh, you're not meant to be doing this right now. And three HP on Aspas. This is really concerning now. It is, but it's still an operator, and we know what the law is. Out of the HP, you can still do as much damage as possible, but it is a 2v2. All I'm saying is, I saw that series that Les had. Tommy could find the kill. Tommy really could. Tommy becomes the third man of the team. So maybe it is a 3v2. And maybe it doesn't matter because Marv is holding that cross and ass bass. Oh. oh. The Molly. It's not even Tommy. It's not even Tommy. Damn, they won the thrifty. It. That's insane. Optic, zero right in that round. No. No, that's fine. That's a huge issue. He can just spam this cross if he wants to. At least a bit of damage as well towards Victor. Not a great deal. Wow. It's Aspas who are the back line who are unrelenting and unmoving. Look at them again. Crashies just out swings and takes down Aspas. He peeked into the. Together to to as Crashies now left in a very tough scenario. 13 seconds and you've got a player behind you as well. Crashies knows that this is not going to be comfortable. Hunter Fury is going to come out. Seven seconds now. He's got to try and play the game. He can tackle his one hit if he has to. But the door breaks. No time. He, he takes down less, but I think he's out of time on this. It's done for. It's run down the clock. Is Crashies going to grab the op? Opponent in the end. No. Nope. Looks like Ye wants to try and do this, but it's going to be Aspas on the other side. He slipped through, they have no idea. Now they do. Aspas unleashes Fury, takes down Victor. Static denies Marv, and it's on Ye, who somehow done the same. He spots one, I think he saw another, and it's crashes in combination to find the two on the side. But with the spike left loose, they still need to readdress this. Get that back into process, back into hand, because Loud aren't far away. FNS has got to make a move here. Yes, he's low HP, but he has to. Oh, I think Aspas will be, will kill FNS here. Yeah. <laughs> Too good, Aspas. Now they do at least get a spike back. You'd see the intention on the swing from Aspas, but he couldn't quite get there in time. The wow, he got another? Oh, he does. Crashes goes down, and now it's just one. Yay. And you bring your team back into this attack on the spike, and it's a shot in the back. There's nothing more to be said. It's nine for loud, and they are back in this game, round by round. Do, do Mountain to climb. They've got the climbing boots on, so they good on the journey. I think they know he's right here. Yeah. They heard Mark him CP. Deeper towards Mill, but it looks like he's already been seen yet. <laughs> Still good for it though. Mark can at least punish Aspas. A little pressure towards his B side, and this could be a big. Dude, there's no way that's another that thrifty, that right? Alone. This could be the best chance that they've got it around in a while, but time being bought already. You can see just at the back of the side, Les is still solid enough. The spray comes in. Sassy wants to help out desperately, but there's a problem. Marv, he's behind him. No, he's going to just unleash yet. Yeah, find Sassy, swings in, finds another. Marv digs deep when they need it, but it's still a 2v2, and we've seen these have problems. And Carter still stands, who is the demon. Dude, I swear they knew where the omen was. Like, he was, like, pinging it. Him. You've got to look towards CT as well. Keep that. In the back of your mind, who gets this shot? It. It's marved. What a moment for this man. And Sadak now tries to find his way back in. And Crashy's got to they... round on it. Optic make it to 12. <laughs> and it's off the back of marved in this round. Only a Spectre, though. Has to make it work somehow. Spins in fast. Tries to do some got the dink. Does get a bit of damage on Ye as well. Just going to try and fire it down, but it's crashing towards Bancarda. The site should be open. Yes, there's a backfill of Sadak, but again, it's only a stinger. This is not ideal at all. Lau going to have to fall away from this. Three of them having to reconsider how they get back in on this site. Because right now, Optic are firmly in charge. Lockdown comes through and actually going to pull out the oh. Fury here. So Wait, if they spam the silver. See, Marv's on the back of it. going to find a kill. Yeah, and now it's Les and Sassy. Map one in the balance already, Marv. Going to spot them on the cross and Les actually finds Marv. Now they've got to know the crashes was down below. But can they do anything to deal with him? Can they dig him out of this spot? FNS has been phenomenal this game, but he needs a little bit of it here. Again, trying to just get this one done. Victor delivers it. He delivers the second as well. It's 13 to 9. Optic get map one.